Welcome to Pokemon Fire Red Ashlove Challenge. Well, welcome back. I am Nixalon. This is the Berry Forest. We are playing with Red here. And we are going to be friendly and share berries with others and Pokemon. Uh, don't know what we'll find in here. I was told there were ghosts. I was also told I could find berries, which I can. So you see these little spots on the ground? Berries. I wonder how often they... Dude, there's totally a berry here. No? There should be a berry there. Based on the... The way that little shading for those cells are supposed to work. There should be a berry here, too. Can you only get, like, one berry in the berry forest? Did I just, like, mess up by getting that berry? Can I not get any more berries? What is going on here? Alright. There's a berry up in the corner we can try. I'm gonna keep trying the berries. We already have an execute. Success. Pretty sure this will kill execute. I was wrong. Uh, well shit. Leap Seed is a very frustrating attack when it's used against you. And a very satisfying attack when you are using it. And you could say that's true of most moves, but Leap Seed, like, doubly so because of the fact that it's like a... What is the word I'm looking for? Not a stationary, uh, like a... A secondary move, like, it just helps in the side. Okay, so I guess only some of these? So this just shows you where they could be, and you have to check each one. And they're not always all there. Huh. Interesting. Can I get down here? Yes. I want this item. I don't know what it is, but I want it. Okay, apparently I have to get out of the water. Full heal! Alright, let's get... Uh, I guess we go back up around. I will be honest, I am... I do not know Berry Forest. I've only played through Fire the Fire Red Leaf Green. Like I've played red red and green and well red and blue and yellow like untold numbers of times. But Fire Red Leaf Green I've only played like once or twice. I mean I have the game on my DS. But whatever. So I'm not super familiar with one and two islands. And I know, I don't think I really enjoyed them even when I did play through it, so that would be part of it. There's an item there. I'm like fairly certain. Uh, or this was the way to go. Well, whatever. We'll just keep going. If I miss an item in this forest, I'm not super concerned. Um, it would be nice to have more berries, but they're not. They're not gonna make or break the game for me at this point. And I really just kind of want to get back out of the place. Because I don't have... I don't have somebody else that I can, like, trade or do all the little, like, side stuff that you get to do. In other... There's a drowsy. I, like, as I walked up to this girl, I was like, there's a freaking drowsy coming. I just recalled... That, so I do, obviously I've played it and remember some things, because I just remember the drowsy. Or maybe it's a hypno. There's something coming. There's one of those two that's coming. Yeah. So something attacked a little girl. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's a hypno. Level 30 hypno. You son of a bitch. All right, well, let's use our stab. That's not gonna do shit. Get out of here, Hypno. And then we can wing attack. I was trying to get the stab bonus from the Ancient Power, but apparently it's a pretty low chance to get it because I haven't seen it yet. Yeah, give me, I pop a berry. Sweet. And it just teleported me to Island 2. That's great. Or 2 Island or whatever. 
I didn't have to go on the boat or anything. I love it. What's up? Because you're the only person that wouldn't, that like, would take the freaking rock. I've been offering it to everybody. You're the first person to be like, oh, yeah, I'll take that ugly ass rock. So you turned my meteorite that came from the moon into a moonstone. I'm not coming with a friend because I don't have one. <laughs> that made me sad. I don't have friends. Alright, what's going on here? Oh, nice. That didn't really add a whole lot. But I'll take it. I'll take some soda pops. Appreciate. Appreciate it. Okay, so we did Berry Island. We got berries. We got Lostel. We got rid of the stupid rock. We killed all the motorcycle people. So I think we're done with Sevi Islands. There's there's seven Sevi Islands, but the other ones you need like passes or, or other tradable or stuff from like other generations. And then you can get like some legendaries and stuff, but I think we're done with the core of what we can do right now. Maybe maybe another island unlocks after you beat the Elite Four, I'm not sure. If it does, I'll look into it. But at this point, I think I'm ready to get the hell out of here. Bill, you ready? No. I hate both of you. You guys are so gay for each other. And I'm okay with that. I just don't want to be the one watching it. Like, I want to go home. I don't think you will. I don't even want to. I want you anywhere near me. I like how they cut out the walking to the boat. They're like, this guy is done with the islands. Just put him on the boat. Get him the hell out of here. And then where did you go? Like, you, you suck. I don't even care. None of that matters. It's all in the past. We're going to stop off and see Mom and Professor Oak. And then we're going to get our 8th badge. Hey mom, how's it going? Check us out. You wanna see this? I got 7 badges. Look at it. Yeah, the volcano badge and everything. It's super cool. The time says 38 hours and it has not been 38 hours, but I've been fast forwarding during grinding. Which is why that number is much larger than it should be. Wow. So that's horribly inaccurate. Thank you, DS. Or Visual Boy Advance, whatever you are. Emulation software. What's up, Oak? Aww. Oh, we can get the amulet coin? Huh. I don't even know where we would go to get that. Sure, it's one of the root like areas, but I just I don't care that much. Oh, wait, we can give you guys items. And by items, I mean berries that we got, because we got berries. Yeah, you definitely need the chest of berry. That saved you. Let's see what you can get. Uh, poison. A bunch of medicine crap. All right, we'll grab. I grab the Pecha. I mean, if our psychic type gets poisoned, it's good to be able to avoid it. And here we go. This is exciting. We're on the road to Viridian City, and now we made it. And now it's time. Tell me it's open. Yes. Yes. I knew it was. I just wanted him to tell me it. It's 
So Gary's already won. No one knows who it is except, you know, me, because it's Giovanni. Oh, it's Paddle Boy! Hey, Paddle Boy Cole would like to battle. I didn't know, I thought they were only in the Koga gym. But no, there There's some here too. All right. Whoa, Paddle Boy. That's the first time that intimidate would actually be useful. Unfortunately, you got critted. <laughs> Go Terra. It's your birthday. Um Double Intimidate. That kind of sucks. I'm gonna go out to Guppy. Oh shit, Pursuit. I gotta be wary of that in this gym. Okay. Well, thank you for the heads up that Pursuit is a thing that I need to worry about. How much is Strength doing? Okay. This is gonna be a, a challenging gym. And I'm really excited because we haven't had a really challenging gym in a while. And I think having gym number eight keep us on our toes is really, it's really going to be good. No, I'm pretty sure I can, I can hit you with a couple strengths now that you're paralyzed. I was contemplating using the hydro pump, but it, yeah, it wasn't needed. I like this. I am liking this. Paddleboard Coal. Couch Whiplash. Oh, that's so... I need to stop taking things the wrong way. Okay. Uh, I don't actually think that's true. I'm pretty sure I could just, like, take any guy, like, with Krav Maga, and he'd kill you. Um... Let's see how much a wing attack does. Okay. Did you use revenge? Uh, this is neutral. Don't kill me. Oh, man. I gotta stop cutting it so close with revenges. It's... It's really terrifying. That was... It was really too close for comfort. <laughs> That wouldn't even matter because it's. We just discussed Krav Maga. M Muay Thai. I don't know, like. Jiu Jitsu. There's, I'm sure there's like a shit ton of fighting styles that are better than karate. Um. Was, what is. Where am I, where am I going? <laughs> there's so many trainers. I'm gonna go back around. I feel like there is more to do. Yeah, I want to fight this guy. What's up, buddy? What did you guys do? Did you were you all living in here while it was closed? Because there's like seven people in this whole town. So were twelve of you just living in this big empty building? Like, I don't know, like fucking gypsies or something? That's really creepy. What the hell? Uh, I. I think the solution here is to go to Paris, hit you with a toxic, go back to Terra. Yeah, because now that you know I'm grass, you're gonna go for the. You're not gonna go for the sand. Okay, I was expecting the poison sting, but maybe you don't have poison sting? I can nail the toxic. I can do it. You can do it. No one cares about the sand attack. Just hit a toxic. Okay, that's not good. Come on. Just, I hate accuracy downs. Thank you. Finally. Okay. Now we're back in this. Stupid ass sand slash. Alright. So now we go to Terra. Slash isn't going to be super effective. Yeah. That's fine. And this will help because wing attack while doing decent damage is not going to be super effective. So it's not going to be like a two. It's, it would have been a, probably a four hit kill. 
I mean, I probably could have just gone straight for the wing attack, but then I would have gotten sand attacked, and they would have started missing... Super Potion. Huh. Alright. Whatever floats your boat, buddy. And then... Poison will either kill you, or I'll kill you on my... On my fly turn. I don't think the wing attack would have killed him. He would have had to die at poison and I would have gotten hit again. So that was... That was the move to avoid getting hit again. Nice. Oh, plus four attack. Dude, look at how fast he is. And his attack stat, damn. I mean, it's not the highest attack stat, but it's it's definitely good. Uh, we... Okay. I don't know what moves you have. I don't think you have rollout. You probably have stomp. That's what I'm about to rock blast. Okay, that's worse. Please stop at two. Please stop at three. Fuck me. Oh. Shit. Fuck, Paris. Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't see the rock blast coming. I thought he was going to stomp. I'm going to avenge you, buddy. God damn it, Rhyhorn, you bastard. Ah. Sucked. It sucked hard. I hate Sand Slash. You're not a dangerous Pokemon. You're just a freaking wall. You just stop combat. Make it boring. Get rid of you. <laughs> Shoo. Ah. God. Paris, you were doing so well. Mm, so sorry. Alright, how much will a sludge do to a poison type of the same level? Not a lot. How much will a shockwave do? God, Paris, damn it. I don't even know what we'd have to replace Paris. Okay, so you must have a lower special defense that shockwave's doing more damage. Well, it's also that you're not resistant to this. But it's also not stab. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Shockwave's the move that we'll use. God. Mmm. That, that sucks. That really sucks. Fucking, fucking A, Paris, man. Okay, this... This is bad. Uh, Guppy has the Intimidate for his physical attack. Um, which Thrash is physical, so that's good. And he's gone to ground type, which means he's immune to the water move, or to the electric move, so Shockwave wouldn't have helped. Um, so I'm going to try to hit him with a Hydro Pump, and I'm going to miss probably all five times, which is going to be bad. But at least he's confused himself. That's the beauty of Thrash, if you can survive it. <sighs> Come on, hit yourself. Jesus. Okay, last time. And then I have to heal after this. Oh, thank God. Okay. Whew. Okay. Good job, James. Good work, Guppy. I hate you so much, Samuel. You bastard. You gypsy bastard. Well, that sucks. I was not expecting that in the slightest. But that's what happens. I mean, that's that's the pain of a Nuzlocke. Sometimes shit just happens. What did you even have? A quick claw. 
I'm so sorry, Paris. You were you were a good addition to our team. I was glad to have you. And I am sorry to see you go. You will uh you will be missed. R.I.P. Paris. R.I.P. Okay. We've got enough water types. We've got a rock type already. We've got a poison type that has electric. What we don't have is fire. Not that I think we necessarily need fire. But after the whole unicorn thing and not being able to find it, getting an Epona, getting my little Ponyta, I'm super excited. I'm super excited. So yeah, let's heal up. God, that sucks. Um, let's see what our Pokemon have in items. We gotta revamp what we're going into this gym with. Because they are not playing anymore. Alright, Chester Berry's fine. Cleanse Tag. What's your speed? 61? Are you the slowest? Yeah, you're definitely the slowest. Okay, so you're getting the Quick Claw. Item. Take. The Quick Claw is definitely better than the Cleanse Tag. I mean, I think we only had the Cleanse Tag because we like didn't have another hold item. Okay, so then what are you working with? Chesterberry, you need to get the Mystic Water because you actually have a water move now. So let's get that. Now you can see all the stuff I have in my. Take that out. Anything else? No. Okay. So we're going to give Guppy the Mystic Water. Yes. And then you have the poison berry. You have the black sunglasses. And I guess we give you a berry. Don't know why I went to the TM case. That was weird. Chesto. Yeah, Chesto berry to wake you up. Okay. And then, yeah, I guess. Let's lead off with, uh, I mean, I know this is, actually, let's, I don't even know what moves you have. <laughs> I'm like, I already throw Epona on the team. I didn't even look at it. Okay. Epona. Rash. As was my choice to add you to the team. Uh, solid attack. Good speed. Really low defense. That's not great. You have the ability to escape. That's, that's okay. Nah, you don't really have a good move. You do have fire moves, which I'm really excited about. You also have stomp. And take down. Okay. And what is your... Because fire is special, so... It is going to do more damage. It's only 8 points difference. It's not too bad. It, it'll get more drastically different. More drastically different. Okay. That's interesting. Do we go right back in, or do we get Epona up to, like, a higher level? Hmm. I don't know. I can't decide. I haven't decided. Um, let me look at the time. Actually, this is this is in our right place to call it for today's episode. So yeah, uh, that sucks that we lost Paris. Hopefully, Epona here will live up to live up to the reputation and be an awesome member of our team. And I think I'll look and see when she evolves into Rapidash, and if it's like thirty-five or forty, we might level her up to that before we take the gym back on. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. Um, and yeah, next time we'll hopefully make it through the rest of Giovanni's gym and get our eighth badge without losing a team member. <laughs> that would be awesome. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.